everyone, welcome back to my channel. I was just sat editing this video and I realized I hadn't actually done an intro, so hi, welcome. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating this office, um, the one that, as you can see, has been decorated already. Um, we turn it from being quite cluttered, uh, also quite bland, it was very overwhelmingly white <laughs> and grey. Yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will, of course, leave links down below um, where I can about things that I've used, paint, um, items, um, desks, furniture, things like that. So yeah, enjoy the video. And don't mind Eric, he's just sat next to me. Yeah. Hey, don't mind me. <laughs> Hello everyone. I know I will have done like a an intro to this video, um, like in the future somewhere, <laughs> but we are in the middle of decorating the, well, what was the spare room slash our office. It used to have like a, um, I've definitely got footage I think of like previous videos or like an old house tour or something but we did obviously have <laughs> oh my god i'm so sorry bless you <laughs> we did have a um one of those ikea pull out beds that pulls out to a double here we've kept the um <laughs> the quilts here for now as like a bit of a transition because basically that was like where the dogs would lie all day long because eric would work in here on his computer and the dogs would literally just sleep here so we've kept the quilt for now and we're gonna eventually clinking there um as you can see <laughs> we've taken down one of the shelves basically we had one of one of the ikea billy bookcases were was in pretty well really good condition to be honest um it had next to no marks um so we thought we'd just sell it for 20 quid better than just going to the tip you know repurposing and reusing so we're selling that someone's picking that up tomorrow so that one bookcase there's gone for now i'm sure I'll put a clip on of one there was two. There was like two cases full of stuff. This other one, um, unfortunately, this one's like extremely old. And I'll try and turn you around to show you two seconds. I don't know if you can see because I've got stuff in front of it, but it's quite discolored. Like in comparison to the other one, like this, it's kind of yellow, and I don't know why. <laughs> don't know why. So this bookcase, we're just gonna put up. Um, once we've sorted all of this stuff out, we're gonna obviously we're getting rid of the Blu-rays. We're selling them um dvds i think they're just going to go to the charity shop and then we're going to kind of sort through our ornaments a little bit decide which ones are like must keep which ones we can sell which ones we're just gonna put away because like they're sentimental i don't know um yeah so after that this bookcase is gonna go up for free i think just online see if anyone does want it um and if it takes too long if no one wants it for free i don't know i thought it might be useful for like someone's garage or something i'm not sure um yeah so if that if it doesn't go we'll we'll just have to take this one to the tip but um yeah then so bed's gone one bookcase um is gone this one's going to go then basically me and eric have booked a week off in april for my birthday and we thought we could use that week because we won't be working to move the computers out of the room safely because we won't need them for a week so it doesn't matter and then we're gonna sell this table if no one wants to actually like buy it, buy it, um, we can actually get a decent amount back at like actual IKEA. So we're just gonna take it to IKEA if no one actually wants to buy it, get everything out of the room. So basically strip it, clean the carpets, um, and then we're gonna paint the walls. And then we have lots of new, beautiful furniture ready to come in here. Um, I think we're also gonna get new curtains. I'm not sure. I'll have to double check on that. But yeah, and then we've also got like a, no a lovely new bookcase, which is gonna go here um two new desks so instead of sharing one desk we're gonna have two desks that kind of like are back to back but they're like kind of corner desks i don't know if i'm <laughs> describing this very well um yes so hopefully next time you see this we'll be taking everything out of the room cleaning it and getting it prepped for painting and decorating and then we can get everything back in I just thought I'd do like a little update <laughs> of what we were doing while we're doing it because otherwise it would just be loads of like random clips thrown together um anyway i'll speak to you next time we're doing it hello so a few more days have passed and we i think the last time i vlogged was after we got rid of the bed and when we were getting rid of one of the bookcases because someone was collecting them well i've been sorting through all the ornaments and stuff in the other bookcase um here so kind of packing up a box that are to go away temporarily to put back out once we've redecorated this room and then a box of things that are gonna go away like things we want to keep but we just don't want to have out also got um gosh this is like a pile of stuff that's gone in the bin um i've got 
two boxes for, of DVDs and Blu-rays got a charity. I've got a box of DVDs and Blu-rays that are going to go um, in the post to CEX. Um, and then we're going to, because this bootcase is like pretty crappy, we're going to list it online for free if anyone wants it. And if, if no one collects it, we're just going to, um, I suppose, break it up and take it to the tip. And tonight, excuse the mess, because obviously we've been like sorting things out but we're gonna um take apart this well either tonight or tomorrow it depends what we've got time for but the table we're gonna take apart and we're just gonna take that up to ikea for their buyback scheme which is quite handy um i'll leave a link to it down below just in case anyone didn't know about it but basically the buyback furniture that um they sold you and it's obviously like a way for them to recycle furniture and then also you get a bit of money for it um it's obviously nowhere near as much as if you were like selling it um online but I've had it online for a while and no one seems to really want it. Um, I think because it's, you know, it's it's quite specific, like selling like such a large like desk with adjustable legs. So yeah, I'm just going to take it to Ikea instead. Um, I'm going to take the computers out and put the computers in the little room for now. And then we can, um, once everything's out of this room, which we're hoping to do, obviously the quilt and stuff can go in the loft because we don't need to keep the quilt out unless we have people staying over. Um, and we've also bought the dogs a brand new nice little like mattress type dog bed for in here once the room's all sorted then we plan on cleaning the carpet while the room's empty so clean the carpet and then we can get on with painting the walls and then and then all the furniture that we've got sat in boxes downstairs can be built and brought up so and then after that it's like just finishing touches like maybe we'll get like a nice little clock maybe we'll get some nice little stationary bits you know things like that um so yeah really looking forward to doing this whole like transformation video so this room has kind of become storage temporarily uh, while we're sorting out all of this okay the room is pretty much empty the walls and skirt and boards obviously need a clean I'm gonna hoover and do the carpet cleaner but yeah sorted So it's now quite a bit later in the day after I cleaned the carpets this morning. Um, we've just been to see our friend's baby that they've just had. Um, so it is like quite a bit later in the day. Um, but we're still gonna crack on. We're gonna get some um, lines drawn on the wall because when we paint the wall, we're actually gonna do like a half wall effect. Uh, Charlie's aggressively <laughs> sniffing the floor because obviously it's been cleaned and it smells different. Um, yeah, so we're only going to do like a half wall, so the top half will still be white and the bottom half will be like a really nice sage green colour. Um, yeah, so I'm quite excited to get that done. I don't think we'll get it painted tonight because obviously, you know, it takes a long time to paint, but we'll definitely get the line done in preparation because obviously it's Easter weekend and we're quite busy. So, um, obviously today we were seeing a friend's new baby, tomorrow I'm at a baby shower um, and it's like actual Easter. So, um, it's just trying to get it all done like around other things that we have to do. So yeah, hopefully once it gets painted, it's not too bad because then it's just building the furniture and getting things back in the room and putting things in the right place. Um, so yes, that's the next job.
now the next day. <laughs> Excuse the noise on the floor. It's um, a dust sheet. Um, I've just had a lovely time at Alice's baby shower. So excited for her to have a little baby. Um, I've come back, sorted the dogs out because I feel bad. It was like an hour and a half after the normal lunch time because Eric's took my nana up to Berwick. So, um, but they're fine. I'm sure they'll survive one day of having their dinner a bit late. I thought now that I'm back and the dogs are sorted, um, and Eric's I think driving home now, so he'll be like an hour and a half or something. Um, I thought I might as well start the painting. I'm gonna get changed into my scrubby clothes, um, and. Yeah, make a start on the painting. Troy's enjoying it in here, aren't you? There's loads of space, isn't there? Loads of spaces for activities. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's get changed into old clothes. Also, this really needs to charge, so I need to put this on charge quickly. a bit later in the day now as you can see it's like dark outside but it's looking so good I think we're gonna do the second coat now so excited to see what it's gonna look like also accidentally matching the wall with the top but it's looking really cute love it I'm not sure if I've shown you like yeah or not but it's this um John Stone in natural sage and this is just the matte one <laughs> nervous in case it hasn't worked the way I want it to I think you just need to do it slowly though yeah that looks good so far doesn't it don't jinx it yeah. <laughs> apparently if you don't take it off while it's wet mm, rub your ball off oh no what the hell it's okay, I've got white, haven't we? Mm -hmm. I just ran up the stairs and now I'm a little bit out of breath. Um, it's Easter Sunday, so me and Eric had a bit of a chill morning. We've just had like a little at-home afternoon tea, which is dead cute. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to clean away all this stuff on the floor and then we're going to get started on building some furniture because we're pretty happy with um, how many coats we have on the paint. It looks like a really nice colour, it's nice and smooth. The only thing I'm really bothered about is... We used frog tape. Normally when I'm painting, I just use um, like just standard masking tape. But this time we actually bought frog tape and I'm not keen, I'm not gonna lie. I'll show you what it's done. It's actually taken away some of the white paint that was already there, which is so fucking annoying because I don't think, well, we don't have any more um, of the touch up paint. So we're gonna have to go and buy some. Um, thankfully it's only happened in a few places, but it's just a bit annoying, you know? <laughs> Wish it didn't happen because now it kind of ruins the finish of this wall, so never mind. Anyway, I'm going to clean all of this up, pick up the dust sheet, and we're going to start building furniture.
have one bootcase up and sorted. Obviously, we'll just have to like decorate it when we're done with everything else. But Eric's currently bringing one of the desks up and we're gonna move on to that now. We've got our desks in and chairs in the way we want them. Now it's just a case of basically sorting through all of the stuff that we removed from the office, which is currently on the stairs or in this little room, um, and kind of putting them back to where they belong. What do you think? Me too. Um, yeah, anyway, so we're basically okay. both going to have our own little space, which is quite cool. Sounds good. I went for the grey chair. I'll leave links to everything we've used down below. Uh, Eric went for the black. I personally thought because I've got white dogs it'll get hairy, but. It's supposed to go in the arch of your back, I think. Anyway, I'm going to start sorting the books out. Do you want to take all the stickers off the shelves? You don't care. The pub do this. This is going to go by a reader in a minute. So it's now the next day and we've started kind of like moving things back in this room. Obviously we need to like organize it quite a lot. <laughs> um, we've ordered another shelf to go here because we've realized we don't have enough room. So we've ordered like a thin taller one to go here so that it looks quite cute. So everything will move along a little bit. Um, yeah, so this is kind of how it's looking now. Um, computers are all put together. I did my wires last night, um, got like wire, like cable holders um eric's gonna do his layer today and we're gonna order some frames not order but we're gonna go to the shop and get some frames gonna get some new curtains put some pictures up we have like a lot of stuff that's going to the skip we've now emptied this room i can't remember if i showed you but basically we'd put loads of stuff in here there's some stuff that kind of has to stay here for now like this stuff and then this is like the bedding that was on the spare bed um but now this room's empty and we're going to see if the air bed will fit in here for when people stay over. Uh, don't know what we're going to do if it doesn't fit. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we've still got just a few things to sort out. Hey, Minx. What are you doing outside? Um, we're going to go to the skip now, yeah? Yeah. Take that chair as well, please. You go to the chair? Yeah, no one wants it. Oh, I've advertised it everywhere. So yeah, we're going to go to the skip. And then we're going to go to B&M and get all like the last minute things we need actually I did write a list somewhere where's that let me make sure we take this okay so we're back from doing a bit of shopping and I thought I'd show you some of the things I've got although it's looking very messy in here at the minute but hopefully everything will be finished by tomorrow the only thing we won't have finished is um, these because we actually need to print out the pictures um, as in get them professionally printed because we're going to put some of our wedding photos up so that's probably not gonna be done until like probably next week now. Um, but I think we could put the frames up so we can see where they're gonna go. I think we're gonna put one there and then like do a little gallery over there maybe. We'll see. Um, anyway, I'll show you what we've got. We've got this beautiful clock. Um, that's upside down. This was from The Range. It was only 20 quid I think and we're gonna put that up in the middle between our two computers. Let's move some stuff out of the way at the same time as going through these um got some cork boards which we're gonna have on either side of the desks 
So we've got one each because obviously this is like an office space. So that means we can stick things up. Again, they were also from the range. They were very cheap as well. I'm sure they were only like three quid or something. Um, we've got these curtains to go up in here. We had a look around and I feel like curtains are so hard to pick because they can really like make a, <laughs> a big difference in a bad way or a good way to your room. So we just went with um, a nice charcoal colour. Uh, not 100% sure if this is the right size, but we'll find out. And if it's not, I have got the receipt. So I've got them. Again, I think they were only like 20 quid. Um, right, I've got, I've got these drawers. These are for my desk. Um, Eric said he didn't really want any. He doesn't think he'd use them. So I've got myself some stuff because I do end up with a lot of clutter on my desk, especially because I have like a vlogging camera and uh, memory cards and all that sort of shit. So I thought they would be useful for my desk. I've got two of them. They were supposed to be six ninety nine each, but they were on offer for, I think, five ninety nine each. So they're quite cute. Um, got an extension, so that me and Eric can have our own extension. That means we can also hide them behind our PC tower. Um, you know the basic kind of stationery. Oh, I got that to go on my um, <laughs> I got that to go on my leather jacket because I collect pins and I saw that and I just thought it was like the cutest little thing ever. It's a little mini if it focuses. Little mini Voldemort cute i'm gonna put that up there so i don't forget it um got extra pins for the cork board so they were like a quid or something i got this little case in for sticky notes um we finally ran out of our like you get given when you buy a new build you get given like touch and touch up pots for the walls um i have no idea if this is the right color all i know is that it was a matte paint um surely there's not too many whites um i'm not sure if you remember in an earlier video but the tape the frog tape took off some of the paint on the wall so i got that also it's probably just handy to have a touch of paint in general so it's quite out of there um yeah like i say we've got various different size frames to make a little gallery wall um again these were all just like the cheap ones from uh the range i much prefer having like quite a thin light frame because we don't like to put pictures up with nails and stuff if possible i don't really like having like nail holes all over the wall so we use command strips so these are nice and light and should be fine to stick up um i got this because we needed a replacement for in the bathroom anyway so i picked that up um then we went to ikea because the other day when we took our old desk back we were given like a voucher so we used some of it on this and then we just paid the difference in cash we have quite a few of these smart lights around the house now that are compatible with Alexa. So decided to get one from the office as well because we've just got a normal one at the minute and just be handy. If you know if you're sitting at your desk and it gets a bit dark, you can just ask Alexa to turn the light on. So got another one of those. Uh got this um lampshade to go up there just so it matches the rest of the aesthetic of the room. And I guess this one can just go somewhere else. I'll see where where I can go if not I can just see if anyone else wants it got this basket to go at the bottom of the new um shelves that I've ordered that are coming tomorrow so I'll show you what I mean for that when it comes and last thing I'll move these yeah the last thing I got is a little footstool to go down there because I'm quite short and I need one <laughs> otherwise I'm kind of always constantly sitting with my feet dangling um Eric has like a little black one but I think it's actually um he's only got it from Amazon I'll leave it linked down below. He loves it. It's quite comfortable, but it's a bit too low for me. I needed a bit of a bigger one. So I got this and this was also from the range. The range is killing it at the minute for homeware. They had some really cute ones with little tassels on as well, but we thought the cat, <laughs> we thought the cat would chew them. So we just went for like a plain one. It's going to be under the desk anyway. So the plan today is to kind of sort out the desks a little bit. Some of this stuff can be put away. This is all stuff that we didn't really know where to put just yet. <laughs> So we're going to sort all of this out. Like I say, we are getting another shelving unit to go there. So we'll be able to put up some more of the books. Um, these are from like, I put these between the curtains normally. Oh, we can probably get the curtains up tonight. Yeah, so there's actually not too much we can do until tomorrow, to be fair, when the new shelving unit comes. Hi, baby. Hello, have you been outside? He loves to um come in and tell you I've, every time he's either had a poo or he's finished a meal or he's been having fun outside he likes to come and tell you don't you yeah are you gonna come back out this room now because you're definitely gonna chew those wires come on OK, 
okay, it's now the next day and the shelving unit has just arrived in the post. So we're gonna build that and then we're gonna move this one along and put it next to it and then we've got a bit more space because we've got all of these like things still to put up and we are gonna sell some of them. We've also just been at the charity shop, took all the Blu-rays and DVDs, um, picked up a couple of new books while I was there. So hopefully these are good. So that brings us to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I also hope you like it. Um, obviously me and Eric love it, which is why we decorated it this way. And yeah, we're just really happy with how it turned out. We now both have our own desk. We have our own little tiny space to, um, I don't know, be in work mode or when we're playing games, we're not like elbowing each other practically because we're like right next to each other or being able to see each other's screens, um, stuff like that. Um, yeah, I'm personally just really happy with how it turned out. What about you, Eric? Do you love it? Love it. Love it. Now you can't screen watch. Can't screen watch. Noise. So if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like down below. Subscribe to see more videos like this. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.